New Stages Southeast project, which is developed by several Goethe institutes in the southeastern Europe, is actually um, aiming to connect theatre artists from different countries and to explore what is the new playwriting in contemporary theatre. For this specific workshop, we tried to target plays for young audiences because we believe that, especially in our scene in Serbia, this uh, part of theatre is kind of neglected. So we wanted to motivate them to write and explore topics that might interest young audiences. Čitava kultura za decu nije više zanimljiva. Zato što niti imaš slavu, niti imaš novac, niti si priznat. Jednostavno, to je kod nas ispod radara, nažalost. We chose several young playwrights to participate and have an opportunity to work with mentors in several workshops during the whole year and develop new plays. I think that making that bridge between the artist or person who creates a workshop or a, a some sort of program and between the audience, uh, that link is the most important thing for me. Me and my colleagues have created a number of plays for kids actually, and it's a really great experience because they don't teach you that much in the college about it, and you get to practically do it, and you need to find your way about it. So I think it's really great. The response we got from uh, six young authors actually does reflect uh, quite well concerns both of young authors and I think also uh, of young audiences. It does say a lot about the youth culture nowadays, it says also a lot about pop culture, it says a lot about internet and it says a lot about this uh, actually the relationship between structural and individual problems. During these three days in Belgrade we have a guest uh, lecturer Gerhild Steinbuch from Vienna. It was very interesting for me to read all the different texts and also get the chance to talk to all the participants about their text regarding the structure, the dramaturgy, and also hear about how they write and how they think about texts. Most of the texts translate, let's say, some online formats and definitely internet slang language into their own worlds and, and texts. So one uh, text is actually called the Story Not Story. It could be even maybe performed solely through stories, etc. And it's also concerning uh, with the type of language that emerged through Instagram. Well, I think it's always good to assume that the audience is um, interested in exploring new forms, which also correspond with reality, because of course reality changes. And at the moment it changes in a, in, in, in a very um, disturbing way in some ways. So, um, this and then I also think that um, it's um, important to take the audience seriously. Um, and to um, not underestimate them. The workshops with uh, Gerhild and Anna and Tanya uh, were very useful in developing this play that I'm developing now with Cleopatra, the playwright. And uh, it also helped me in a, in a future career sense by uh, reminding me that there are so many artistic forms and it doesn't have to be this um, classical theater on a stage uh, type of art for it to be performative or theatrical. So I think it was pretty useful, yeah. I mean, writing for a younger audience is very hard because a younger audience, um, they are not polite. Um, and if they don't like something, um, they will show it offensively. So I think writing for them is a very um, interesting task. In this final workshop days, we actually are focusing more on a very theatrical process of rehearsals. And we are trying to simulate a rehearsal process in the theater from several different perspectives, be it a performer perspective, director's perspective, dramaturg's perspective, or thinking even beyond theatrical formats, let's say exhibitions, audio works, graphic novels, etc. The project that I'm working on is a play and then a rehearsal reading and then a show. And all of it is going to be about the story of um, a Romanian woman's immigration and uh, beggary. It's an important uh, thing to destigmatize and work around this term of begging. Mislim da je važno za decu da bude kontinuitet. E to kod nas nema. I uopšte kada je kultura za decu u pitanju, na pojedincima je. Znači mi nemamo sistem, nego je jedan bibliotekar, jedan učitelj, jedan reditelj i onda on vuče. Eto, to je možda najveći problem što mi nemamo nikakav sistem za kulturu, za decu i mlade. Investing into new theater artists and also connecting independent scene and institutional scene 
could be the real way to find really intriguing uh, topics that might, uh, in the end, actively involve audience.